Hello there and welcome to some Crusader Kings 2 with the Game of Thrones mod. Today we're going to be playing as King Damon Blackfire, the first Blackfire Rebellion. And hopefully the last. We're not going to uh, fail now, are we? And have our descendants fight for the next hundred years. How long was it between here and Maidies? Uh, what am I? Nine Penny Kings is 2959. Oh, so it's not quite that long. It's Let's say 60. Even if it's close to 70. Never mind. Yeah, it's close to 70. But let's just say 60. Not quite a hundred, but... Anyway, let's, uh, let's get to it. Let's dive straight in. I'm going to play with Iron Man mode off. And uh, all this stuff going on. Pause to see what you want to see. And here we go. Good old Blackfire. Although bastard born, I am Targaryen on both sides. Alright, uh, never mind. I am Targaryen on both sides. Seeing this, my father, King Aegon IV, legitimized me in addition to bestowing upon me Blackfire, the sword of Targaryen kings. Rumours around that my half brother, King Daeron II, is the bastard of my uncle, Aemon Dragon Knight making me the rightful heir to the Iron Throne, and I will claim what is mine. So, firstly, we start with 15,000 men over here at Harrenhal. Harrenhal is a great ally of mine. House Lowston has a whole 12,000 men willing to die for us. But let's just make a, uh, let's make a list of houses that support us at the beginning of the game, so we can try and Remember these people later on in life when we try to uh, dish out rewards for loyal service, of course. And we have uh, you gentlemen over here. Not you, yes, you you are involved. Your sisters, very good. Um, of course, uh, Harren Hall. We have the, uh, the Claw men over here, very good. And we have all of these houses around these areas. House Peak, very good. House Ball, very, very strong supporters of our cause. What about you? No, you are neutral. Uh, Darkdale, very good. And then there is Old Town. There is also the Loyal House of Ironwood. Very good, very good. And then it's just uh, House Rain up here. Very good indeed. So that's everybody who supports us at the beginning of the game, in fact, is it? Nope, there is also uh, Cornfield. Now I believe that is everyone who uh, supports us at the beginning of the game. It is indeed. So let us start with picking an ambition. We would like to see our house on the Iron Throne, and we're going to take the uh, ambition or focus of war. As my children, let's select them some uh, focuses. My initial two oldest boys, the most important people I have. Very good. Now, we'll betroth our eldest son to his sister. Very good. Very good indeed. Let's just go through our bodyguards. We have a lot of formidable fighters to choose from. We are very, very blessed in that regard. We can have a full complement of formidables, I believe. Excellent. Very good. No, we'll not have my mother there. And then as for generals, um, we'll replace you with you. Very good. Now let's see who else will join our court. Any other great generals? Yes, there is Ulrich Dane. Very good. We'll invite this, this man over. Uh, Rob Rain, we'll invite him over as well. Good to have the Reigns on our side. Very, very loyal people. Garth Redding will also invite you over, good sir. Very good. Josmin, is that a man? Josmin Rain is indeed a man. Well, good for him. Lyle Krakul, is he the heir to Krakul? No, he's not. He's just a, uh, a sibling. But the Krakuls are lol, so we will invite one of their members over. Uh, boring. Not, not really worth it, are you? Let's uh, leave that there. Excellent. Now, our cancel is not the most important thing to be worrying about at the moment. I will replace you as I need you as a general. We'll put somebody else like Byron in charge of that. And have him train the children. We will have our command slot given to Egor Pita Steel. Excellent. 
Excellent indeed. Now that the intro is out of the way, let us get to it. In fact, let me just uh, check my auto saves here. Manage settings. Nope, that's not what I'm after. I'm after game options. Auto save interval. Monthly. Yeah, monthly will have to do. Excellent. Oh, we'll put in a quick save there and then we'll get to it. The Valerian Freehold's politics was dominated by 40 families of great wealth, high birth and strong sorceress ability, known as Dragon Lords. They spoke the High Valerian language and had great skill in shaping stone. Incest and polygamy was a common practice among the blood of Old Valeria, and I am the blood of Old Valeria. Excellent, so we are going to amass our army here. I am going to be leading the centre, we'll have Aegor on one flank and Bertrand on the other. I'm going to ask that the Clawman and Riverlanders all join me here. Or all join this army. No, not you. The phrase, the pages, the uh, Shawnee, the Brackens, the Loafstons. Very good. The Mandrakes. Even the Sisterman, if they can reach it, join me here. Excellent. So we'll take this army and we'll march straight for King's Landing. Now there is also the Lannisters who need to be dealt with. We'll send our Westland forces over to here to besiege this. That'll be Houses Rain, Craycall and Swift. Very good. Very good indeed. We'll send them all over there to deal with the Lannisters. Maybe even the Osgreys could go north as we do have a very strong presence in the Reach. Osgreys and the uh, is it Ambrose? I believe it is, Ambrose. Uh, we'll send you over there as well. Excellent. And then there is you. We'll send over to you our forces of the Reach. Very strong forces of the Reach. The Stricklands, however, I could get to join my main force. As for you, Cletus. We could get Cletus and the Stricklands to join me at King's Landing. Let's see what we got. Yes, we'll get you guys to try and join me over there. Excellent. So everybody now has their jobs. They will move however they can towards them. Excellent. The bloodline of House Blackfire lays claim to the traditional ancestral lands. Lands that must be reclaimed. The High Lord of King's Landing. Very good. Excellent. Ulrich, the Sword of the Morning, has decided to join us. We'll give him a command slot as he is a great man. Uh, Ambrose, you are replaced. Excellent. We could even get him on our flank. Very good. Agor is betrothed to my daughter. Very good. We'll set her to have uh, etiquette as her focus. My other daughter, who's betrothed to my son, will get her to go for etiquette as well. My other younger sons, let's get them all on military focus. Hagen, very good. Uh, Viserys, we'll get you on struggle as well. And then there is Aenys and Jaehaerys. We'll get all of the boys to learn how to fight. Jaehaerys, very good. And then my youngest daughter will have her go for etiquette. Very good indeed. Right, now all we have to do is march south. Next, Lyle, Crate Call, Garth, Redding have both joined us. And Ulrich has become Sword of the Morning. Very good. And of course, Sir uh, Rob Rain has also joined us. Another great commander. But we'll have Peter Steele at our flank. We don't need to drop him for an extra point. Now, will there be a Battle of Stokeworth, or are we going to manage to get straight into the King's Landing? There's a small Battle of Stokeworth. And we have missed their main army going south. Right, now he is leading troops in Languid Hall. Languid Hall is here. Are we able to cut off his forces at Firing Cross? We should be able to indeed. Let's go over there and deal with them. Excellent. Illyrio has been captured. And so has... So has King Daron. Well, this is the easiest Blackfire Rebellion I have ever done. 
Um, for the sake of that, I am simply going to execute the man so that we can prolong this war a bit longer. We'll seize. Can we see something from him without tyranny? No, it'll be tyrannical. Okay, well, we are simply going to execute the man. Just so that the war is prolonged. We'll have him beheaded. I can't offer this foreign king. I am now a kinslayer. But it does not matter. It does not matter. These are Targaryens and... Well... We have to do what we can. Now, Baelor Breakspear is the king of the Iron Throne. He is another... Oh, he's a nephew. Oh, he's his son, of course. His mother is a Dondarian. Ah... Anyway, we might not be um, worrying about him for long, because we are going to go straight for the capital. No, he is leading troops in Dragonstone. Well, good for him. Good for him. He's managed to survive and go elsewhere. As for me, I will besiege King's Landing. As is customary when you try to take the throne. Alright, he has a master host over here, and he's going to Shattering Brook. We could cut him off and take out his forces. Now, how are you doing down here? You have 14,000 men besieging High Garden. Very good. As you have 7,000 here, nearly 8,000. How many men do the Lannisters have? 23,000. So they are off somewhere. And then obviously there are your forces, 14,000. Okay. I see. So maybe it is best that I take out his forces while I can. Was you still do have 20,000 men. And I could take out a fair few at Shattering Brook. How long till you get there? 12 to 6 million. Okay, let's wait a bit. No, he's just going to Atdale. We'll wait for him to be stuck at Atdale. Very good. And we'll attempt to meet him there. And then we'll go back and besiege King's Landing. After his forces have been further massacred. There's a dragon. My aunt has a dragon. It's only a small dragon. We'd be able to defeat it very easily. Just like we are able to defeat his forces. Excellent. We'll go back to the capital and attempt to besiege that. Unless we can take out these terror forces. He's going to the Bram's Fort. Right, so we'll go straight round and meet him there. Excellent. Alright, that is quite a battle. And there are more incoming. Quite a fair few incoming. They're going to have a half fall. They're going there. Very good. We do have more reinforcements ourselves. Who's died? Lord of Harrenhal has died, taking near 11,000 forces out of the war. He should declare for me. Excellent, he has. Very good. Sounds like a solid investment. Well, we are currently quite busy for that sort of thing, my good friend. Uh, Viserys sucks. Who the hell are you? Well, you're joining us now, buddy. Now, they have more reinforcements in. I'm still destroying them. If we could just rout off these fellows, we'll be ready for the next load. And that will give us quite a good head start there. Are they still marching in? Or can I catch their forces down here and take them out? As for you... Where are they? You guys should join me and stay attached, please. Excellent. There's more forces destroyed. Can we catch anyone? No, we did not catch anyone here. Maybe we could still catch some forces. We need to lower their numbers while we can. Rob Rain would like to be married. I'll find you someone nice at some point. Don't you worry, buddy. Excellent. Lord Lannister is here. We did not find him. Can I take them out here? And then I'll go straight for the capital. And I'll actually besiege it this time. Ah, there's also the Arryn armies arriving. Let's take out the Arryns. Always got to take out who you can, when you can. 
Now, how are these sieges going down here? You have 25,000 men sieging High Garden, very good. You have 10,000 sieging Castle Rock, very good. We should wait for both of those sieges to be done before attempting to finish the war. Excellent, Lord Arryn is here. And we have found him. Right, we'll send in Aegor first. Aegor has been defeated. That is a huge shame, Aegor. Bit of Steel will not be a part of this story. Small funeral will uh, suffice. Now it's down to me and Lord Paramount, Donald of the Vale. He's no match for my might. Strike, die. The Lord of the Vale has been defeated. Now is our chance. We have, however, lost my brother Bittersteel. We'll replace him in his position with Bertrand. That now means that the Vale is neutral. We could attempt to create peace with the Vale. He has a son, zero-year-old Jasper. We can arrange a patrol between him and my youngest daughter. He will accept. We'll attempt to keep the Arryns out of this. He has rejected it. Has he rejoined in the war? He has rejoined the war. So we'll defeat his uh, his remaining army here. I'll be known as a duelist. And uh, a new command will be needed. Rob Rain, you are now commander. And probably a bodyguard as well. No, we'll give that to Garth. Try not to keep my we'll try not to have my commanders as bodyguards in case they do die. That's right, you better run back to the Eyrie. Wait, who did he kill? Because he's killed somebody. Ah, he killed Master What's his face. That's a huge shame. Let's cross the river and go straight into them. There's no need to wait around here. Go straight into them and then we take King's Landing. This time I promise. I promise you King's Landing will be captured. Ah, uh, the, uh, the Martels have caught up with the war. Right, so we have to wait here for a couple of months. But we have plenty, uh, plenty of patience. We can do that. That'll give plenty of time for the forces of the Reach to take High Garden and, and the forces of uh, the Westlands to help take out Castle Rock. Maybe not entirely, but they will take out a fair chunk of it. Incompetent fools have let a group of smugglers. That's a shame, they are under slave raid. They are a good, loyal house. We should support them how we can. Alright, another month. Fine pros, we'll see it done. Uh, sure thing, Lord Ball. You can be the, uh, the guy for now. Now, can we make sure that everybody is uh, set to join us here? Attach, yes, attach, attach. Yes, they're all set to attach. But I see the these armies here, they're not attempting to attach to me, they are wandering around. I guess maybe the Clawmen are going home as they are under attack. Can't really blame them for that. But very shortly, if we can get these Ironwood men as well, that would be great, the extra 2,000. Terrific. It is time to storm the castle. It is defended by Lord Darklin. And the king has gone into hiding with his family, so we'll not be seeing them. Have his family put into the dungeon. Now, we did lose a lot of men in that battle, but we have to take the capital. Who do we have? Brendan Blood Raven has been captured. We should seize Dark Sister, a sword of House Targaryen, and we should execute the man by beheading. Excellent. How is my son doing? Can we uh, assign you a better guardian, somebody who is not leading troops but at the castle? Um, go for Rob Rain. He's still at the castle defending it. And we'll give him my other son as well. Signed Guardian of uh, Rob Rain. Very good. Now, we need to get our strength back as they do have forces around here. We might be able to engage them. Or we can engage the smaller stack here, destroy them, and then take out the other stack. 
The Sword of the Morning would like a wife. Uh, we'll find him someone nice, but not just yet. Excellent if we can take out these fools, but there are quite a few other armies around here. We might struggle if we can't take them out fast. Where are you going? You're going to Brown's Fort. Very good. So if we can take out these fools, we can take out the other ten Dornishmen. Who? Lord of the Sisters was killed in uh, combat by Torin Tully. That's a shame. When did you arrive? The four teams. We have four days to finish these fools off. Excellent. House Fowler has decided to join us. Right, we did not quite defeat them in time, but we should still... Uh... And Lord Bracken. Lord Bracken has also been slain. A lot of lords are dying in this battle, but... Ah, excellent, the new Lord Bracken has decided to honour his allegiance. We should still be able to win this. Excellent, we have sent these guys back in, but there is another stack of men coming in to fight us. It'd be nice if we could defeat them before they arrive on the 9th and 10th. Well, we should be able to do that easily. We should defeat them the next day. Excellent. A lot of lords died, but victory in the battle was ours. The war is all but won. We'll allow the uh, Siege of High Garden and the Siege of Castle Rock to end before we do anything. But thank you for watching this first episode. If you want to support the channel even further, there is a Patreon link down below. But the most important thing is that you subscribe to stay up to date on all of my content. I'll see you guys next time. Thank you for watching. Goodbye.